Y'all be lighting this bathroom up, shitty bitty bitches. Y'all a bunch of shitty bitty bitches. I come into Whole Foods, the customer service is so freaking trash. Every single time, they don't say hello, they don't say please, they don't say thank you, they don't acknowledge you or nothing. Maybe it's just me, but every time I come into this specific Whole Foods, they just so like, you don't belong here. <laughs> they don't say nothing. I'm telling the man, thank you for my receipt. He just handed it to me. And keep on in his little conversation, like boy, don't play with me. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. So I got some stuff from Whole Foods and we finna try it out. Ooh. I spent eight dollars and twelve cents at the Whole Foods on a bunch of fucking up. I got this little bitty thing of tuna salad and one vegetable samosa. Indian food is fire, so I want to get some. And then I had got some people too. So let's try this vegetable samosa. I know I'm gonna have to pop a Benadryl because it's always onions and everything. Um, it's good, but it smells like pumpkin. Is it pumpkin in here? It's some kind of pumpkin spice. It's some type of pumpkin spice and everything nice in here. It's good though. I instantly just started itching. So, I'm going to some something in there. I got all this food and none to drink. <sighs> Water. Water. Like that SpongeBob episode. Water. Water. Damn, open sesame. All right, now I got the tuna salad. Tuna be stinking. That's the tuna salad. That's the tuna. A little sea salt pita chip. 
It's turning out a little hard. I don't know why my brain told me to get this sweet ass shit. Apples and cranberry and tuna. Either the taste is growing on me or I'm really hungry. It gotta be that I'm hungry. It has to be. 12 seconds later. I ate this whole thing to not be so hungry. For me not to like it. I ain't leave no crumbs for it to be so nasty. I don't grab the pizza chips more than anything. Wow. The ghetto. <laughs> Can I walk around with my titties out? Yeah. Then why you get to walk around with your titties out? Uh, I have titties. No. If I don't get to show my titties, you don't get to show yours. Y'all already know what's the jelly, vegan, non-GMO, butter. Hey Alexa, play a sex, a sex location, cause that's all I know. I can't find the album the six location for that. Play a sex location. Alexa, play a sex location. Playing age slash sex slash location by R. Linux. Yeah, cause don't ever play with me like that. The nerves is yours. What's that they say back in the days when you fish in the sea? A whoop, a whoop, a whoop, whoop. Whoop, a whoop, a whoop. The nerves is yours to think of us. To when you're. Chipotle vinaigrette. Morning, good morning. Ew. Ew. Wow. Good morning, y'all. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome back to another Blizzoggy. I keep doing it like this ain't disgusting. Welcome back to another vlog. <laughs> For starters, my name is Bree Simone. I was gonna say Brianna. Yes, girl. Yes, girl. It's Brianna. What's up, y'all? My name is Bree Simone, and thank you for stopping through because you didn't have to. And secondly, please do not forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And say to a young player. So, y'all, it is Monday morning. I know it's Monday because new week. School started. <laughs> I'm for sure today is Monday. So, today is Monday. It's a new day. It's a new dawn. It's a new week. It's a new peak. A lick a leak. It's a new day, it's a new zone, and we are feeling all right. So, right now, y'all, I'm just leaving the gymnasium, the gymnasium of Planet Fitness. Eh? Um, I was a mess today, y'all. I'm so embarrassed by how I did in the gym today. 
I was only able to last 30 minutes. Normally, I'm in the gym for like an hour, hour and a half, sometimes two. Baby, 30 minutes is all I've been able to give for the past couple of weeks. Granted. Granted, I've been drinking like a fish. Granted, I've been drinking every alcohol known to me. But I guess I felt like that didn't take away from the workout. But baby, my chest. My chest is hurting. Also, I was just talking about people uh, at the gym the other day. Like, um, I had put on Facebook. I'm going to put in what I had put. But I had put on Facebook. Like, y'all got to stop taking them protein shakes or whatever that y'all taking before y'all get to the gym. Because y'all be lighting this bathroom up. Shitty bitty bitches. Y'all a bunch of shitty bitty bitches. Why today I get to the gym and got a shit? So, on top of that. On top of that. I am drinking like a fish while working out and holding in my shit while working out because I ain't about to shit no in no in no public place. I can't I can't sit on toilets. I can't sit on toilets. Like if it's not my toilet, I can't sit on it. Sometimes even like at my mom's, I'm so like I don't want my ass to catch a rash. You know, I don't want my ass to catch a rash sitting on these toilets it's already bad enough having a big butt that you know you get a little piss do that happen to y'all y'all get a little piss on your butt cranks so i'll be having to spread my cheeks across the toilet seat so all the piss can come out without getting on my cheeks you feel me because sometimes i'll be peeing and then be getting on my cheeks and roll down my leg too much information i know but it is what it is my car is so dirty i need to go and get a car wash i did have oh I be y'all I got ADHD sometimes I have ADHD so I can never stick to one subject but like I was saying I um had to poop and I can't I can't poop in public places I'm just walking up on my car bitch I can't poop in public places so I should definitely probably get me a duffel bag. I'm always seeing people in the gym with a duffel bag. And I'm like, I ain't gonna get me no duffel bag. Y'all, I'll be walking into the gym with so much shit in my hand. So much shit in my hand. But I had to boo-boo. I had to boo-boo. And I couldn't boo-boo in the gym. So I was holding it the whole time I was working out because I'm not gonna drive 15 minutes back home. Just the shit. I'm gonna hold that. I'm gonna hold that. So, <laughs> I, um... I can't poop nowhere that's not my house. I legit can't poop nowhere that's not my house. So, yeah. But anywho, y'all, I need to go and get a car wash. I had a car wash coupon. Coupon somewhere for a free car wash and I done lost the shit. It wasn't really free. We paid for it, but we paid for two. One for my car, one for Sam's car and and I done lost the damn coupon so now I'm gonna have to pay the damn three dollars now I'm gonna have to pay the three dollars well the, 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 the ten dollars because I want to wax but yeah so right now I'm gonna go home take a poop drinking my chlorophyll water I'm gonna go home take a poop then probably go to the car wash but I want to jump a little rope first. Since my workout was all that great, I want to jump a little rope just to make it feel like I did something today, I guess. But yeah, so that's what I'm doing right now. Oh, this is so sticky. What's on here? My Apple Watch charger. My car is a mess, y'all. Like, my car is a mess. I really need to clean it because every time somebody get in here, I'm embarrassed. <laughs> Every time somebody gets in here, I'm embarrassed because my car is disgusting. My car is disgusting. Like, every piece of my car is nasty. But yeah. Y'all like my new shades? Y'all like my new shades? I had got them from the beauty supply house. I think they were like $8.99. Oh no. When I'm finna, yeah, they were $8.99. But what I'm finna go do right now is go to the tobacco store because 
I ain't had no calls this morning, so I wasn't able to smoke. And it's, it's a good time. Now was a great time, if you ask me. But yeah, do y'all like these shades? Because I think I had shot this to my mama and she said that they was too big for my face, but you know, I don't give a damn. But these was called Mad Shady or something like that. The little box, that's what it said, Mad Shade. So bitch, I'm throwing Mad Shade with these on. Purr. Her. And I need to get an oil change. My car is on 0% oil. And I'm wondering why my car is jerking. Well, bitch, it's because you have no oil. Duh. Duh, stupid duh. But let me go ahead and get some calls so I can smoke and then I'll see y'all when I get to my next destination really cause I don't know what I'm gonna do. It's Monday. I ain't got nothing to do. I ain't got no money to spend. So, yeah. I want some tacos. What am I gonna cook for dinner tonight? I don't know, but I'll see y'all in a minute. So y'all, I've been hearing that the um, Crunch curls. Y'all know these are hood classic. These are hood mother classic. But I heard they changed the formula. They've changed it before. The very my mouth is just watering. I want to I want these so bad. I want some hot chips so bad. My mouth is just watering. But I heard that they changed the formula. Now back when these first came out, very, very first came out, y'all know they kept that chunk that chunk of hotness at the bottom, that's the formula that they need to go back to. That's the formula that they need to go back to. Then they changed to something else, it was cool. It was still good. Then they changed to something else and it was like, oh. It gave a stale. Now, they said that they have a new formula. And I, I wanna see what's, what's to it, what's to it. But my mouth is just watering. Mm. I want these chips so bad. My butt gonna be on fire. My chest gonna be hurting, but you gotta sacrifice sometimes. It tastes like detergent. Wow. Oh, wow. What? Wow. I am disgusted. I am disgusted. They don't even look the same. They're not even as red as they used to be. They like yellowish. I am disgusted, bro. Wow. I really want to go and ask him for my damn 50 cent bag. Wow. And I got me some flame of hot popcorn. I hate the new flame of hot popcorn. They taste like freaking flame of hot puffs to me. They need to go back to the original with the red bag. But here, that formula, that's better than the freaking crunchy curls. Wow. 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 People crazy. Ugh. I'm mad as hell. I'm mad as hell about that. Like, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm pissed off. I'm pissed off about that. Wow. What would possess you to change that? Golly. And then into that. Boy. I'd rather y'all go back to the car for it. Cause the other ones was gonna taste like cardboard. That tastes like fabric softener. Liquid detergent. It's giving liquid detergent. Real darn. It, that ain't even that ain't even dish detergent. I mean that's dish detergent. That ain't even clothes detergent. It's giving real tide. There we go. Real tide. Real sun. Real game. Wow. Change it 
Change it back. Change it back. Change it back right now. We don't have a problem. Change it back. But this is too much. This is too much. Get off my ass. Get off my ass. Like, where are you going? Looking like a damn bounty hunter. Okay, so hey y'all. Ooh, my pants is wet as hell. I just got done washing dishes. I ain't peeing on myself and I'm like, I'm So y'all, I'm gonna make some dinner real quick. And then I finally got my wig out of my trunk. Let me show y'all. I finally got my wig out of my trunk. Y'all, it looks a mess. It looks a mess. So I'm gonna try to revive this wig. I saw that it said put some I did it once with a um a pull-on wig, like a pull-on pull-on wig, but this is a front tool, and I don't even know how to lay it, so I don't even know if I'm supposed to do it the same way with the fabric softener and stuff, but I want to put a wig on. I want to put a wig on, y'all, so yeah. I want to try to revive this, so I'm about to cook dinner first, and then we're going to try to cook that wig, but right now I'm going to make some dinner. We have having pepper, not pepper steak, we have having steak bites and um, alfredo tonight, so right now I just got the meat washing and soaking, because like I told y'all, wash your meat, wash your meat, I need to put the dishes up. And I see that, uh, I be seeing in my videos that it be always dishes on the stove, y'all. Them dishes be clean. I don't be having no dirty dishes around. The dishes be clean. My house may be junky, but it ain't nasty. It ain't dirty. It's just a little junky. But, yeah. So, we have a steak bite and we have a steak bite in Alfredo. And some croissants. I am about to start back not eating meat because one, I just don't like the taste of it, the texture of it, the smell of it, or nothing. But my body has been craving it, so my body has been craving it, and I've been just trying to get my body what it wants. But baby, it don't need that. It don't need. It. It does not need it. So, I'm about to start back being a pesky. I look skinny though. <laughs> Bitch is looking skinny now. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I want to start back being a pesky. And I want to stop drinking alcohol. I told y'all that earlier. But, I have to. So, yeah. I want to, I want to go back to being a pesky because, baby... It's a mess. And when I try to exercise today, no. But yeah, so like I said, we're going to have some steak bites and some Alfredo pasta tonight. I don't know if I want to show y'all how I'm cooking it because I ain't never cooked it before. <laughs> I ain't never cooked this before, so I don't know if I want to like, I don't want to waste your time. I don't want to waste your time. But if it's good, I'm gonna come back and show y'all the second time. Y'all, I'll put these press-ons on. I had them for my birthday, my past birthday, but they was like stiletto. But I cut the top off because I really hate stiletto nails. I don't even know why I bought them, but I cut the top off and made them a little square. And they ugly as hell. <laughs> They're ugly as hell, but like I told y'all, I need press-ons because I ain't got no hair on. And I don't want nobody thinking I'm no butch queen, okay? But yeah, so I'll see y'all when I'm finna start boiling this wig and shit, cause I need to start making dinner, so. Good morning, lovely people. Good morning, good morning. Yo, yo, good morning. Mm-hmm. It is a new day. It is the next day. Today is Tuesday. I'm quite sure of it. Today is Tuesday. And so right now, it is 8.42 in the morning, and I am on my way out. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm on my way to the grocery store. I'm finna go to Sam's Club really quickly to pick up some meat because I do all my shopping for like meat items, like the big family packs of stuff mm-hmm. at Sam's Club. But they got like ground turkey two packs, two big ass um, family packs for $15. It's normally in the dang on store. It's fifteen dollars for one pack. Two for fifteen? Baby, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. But anyway, so yeah, it's rainy today. It is rainy out in the city today. Okay. And it's can I'm kinda not trying to trip on it too much because I don't want it to be like a little You know when it gets raining outside it becomes a gloomy day. It's not gonna be a gloomy day for me. I put some little makeup on. I ain't really put nothing on, but some lip liner and some gloss, but it did something to me. Yes, it is. But yeah, <laughs> right now I'm on my way headed to freaking Sam's Club so I can get something, some food, and then um, I'm gonna go to the beauty supply store so we can get something to revive that weed. I never got back on here last night because once I got done cooking, y'all, it was over with. But let me tell you something. Them steak bites and Alfredo, fire. Fire. Everybody has seconds and thirds. Everybody has seconds and thirds. And that's not normal in my house. Most of the time, I have a setting, and then that's it. I went back for three plates. Judge your mama. Because, baby, it is what it is. And then... Y'all, let me tell y'all what happened last night. Let me tell y'all what happened last night. So, y'all know how I told y'all in the last video that, I think it was the last vlog. Y'all know how I told y'all in the last vlog that I had a mouse. Saturday, right? No, Friday. Friday, I'm sitting in the house drinking my wine getting litty like a teddy by myself you know what i'm saying i'm a vibe i'm a vibe all by myself you know but oh baby let me turn my damn it just became a real shit storm out here it wasn't even storming at first but the rain is heavy now okay so friday i'm sitting in the house chilling with the lights off Babbing by myself, getting drunk off my little uh little cheap wine from Aldi. That Aldi wine, y'all, it's only $3.99. Go get you some. And it be getting your litty. Litty like a titty titty. Litty like a pierced titty. But yeah, so I'm drinking my wine and whatnot, whatever. And I see the mouse. I see a mouse, right? And I'm like, ah! I was like, bitch, 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 and it ran. A few seconds later, I see it going, weaving through the shoes. Because as soon as you walk in my house, you got to take your shoes off. Like, as soon as you walk in my house, you got to take your shoes off. I have carpet, but I just feel like you stepping in dog doodle. You stepping in human speed. You probably stepping in human piss. You stepping in so much shit. I don't want you traveling around. I don't want you bringing that around my house. Man, I hate allergy season. I don't want you to bring that around my house. So as soon as you come in the house, you gotta take your shoes off. So, us at my house, we never, it seems like we never put the shoes away. They just stay at the door. But anywho, so I'm seeing the, the mouse weeding through the, the shoes. I'm screaming. Ah! take off right where I'm at like it runs straight directly towards me I'm at home by myself I'm always by myself when these things are happening why y'all don't interact why the other people in the house don't interact with the, with the rope so I I, I, I called my mama I called my mama because my mama had my kids and she had my car so I'm like, I call my mama, come pick me up, come pick me up, it's a mouse, come, I, I can't stay here by myself, come pick me up. So she's like, girl, I'm not gonna pick you up. What do you mean you're not coming to pick me up? 
come out at all. They never came out their room at all. I'm doing all this screaming, hooping and hollering and my kids never came to outside of their room. So I walk in there, I'm like, I walk in there, I'm like, y'all didn't, y'all didn't hear me screaming? Both of them like, yeah. I said, y'all wasn't going to check to see what was wrong? I saw the mouse. Both of them just like, we know. What if I was dying? What about my health? What if I was dying? That's how you feel? We know. Wow. It's like, mm -hmm. 
You didn't care. You didn't care about me, and that's crazy. You didn't care about me, and that's crazy. <sighs> wow. Because if it was... Wow. Wow. I woke up this morning. I, first of all, I didn't, have, I didn't have a good sleep. I didn't have a good sleep because that thought just kept going through my mind. So every time I heard something like, we got the windows open and it could be the blast like cricket from the wind, I'm like waking up out of my sleep. Ooh, what, what is that? What is that? Then, today, I'm waking up, you know, getting simple ready for school and whatnot. I'm walking over the spot where I saw the mouse. Y'all, it felt like the mouse was under my foot. It felt like I could feel that dent where the mouse was like it left an imprint or some shit where it was because my feet just was I felt it on my feet I felt it on my feet this morning then I try to put my shoes on I feel like it's in my feet because my shoes was next to where he killed it at my crockies and y'all know I love my crocs especially the grocery shop and run my errands I, I love a good croc but, y'all, when I tell you, shit got real last night. Shit got motherfucking real last night, okay? It was a very terrible experience. It was a very terrible experience that I never wanted to experience again, okay? Never. I hope we I, and I'm like, bitch, I hope this is the last. I hope for a very long time that this is the last of a mouse that I see. Cause I can't do this shit. And then my landlord is just so like, bro, I've literally hit him up ten times in the past week to get an exterminator. And this man has not sent one. But you will be knocking on. But let let me be two or three days late on the rent. He knocking on the door. No, no player, no player, no player from the Himalaya. Uh uh. Don't knock on the door. And then his excuses be, well, I'm I'm building my house right now, so I don't have. Bitch, you what? You think I give a? F about you building your house from the ground up off of the rent that I'm paying you off of the rent that I'm paying you you think that I care about you being busy with your home I'm sure where you live and in your home you don't have to deal with this shit so why the hell should I why the hell should I and why the hell should I accept you being a half ass landlord Make it make sense. But let me not have my ring. Yo ass would be knocking on the door. And it wasn't even that I was even. It wasn't even that I was even late on the rent. I honestly thought that it was already paid. Because I guess the time just went so fast in my mind. That I had thought that it was already paid. Because when he knocked on the door. I'm like. Um. What? Because when he knocked on the door. This was a few months ago. Mind you. This was, this was a while ago. But. I thought he asked. Because this is the last time I had a mouse. I thought he asked if I saw any more. And I'm like, no, nah, I can't say that. Um, You know, we got rid of the mice. And he was like, what? I said, what you just say? And he said, you didn't pay your rent. And I'm like, I didn't pay my rent. Yes, I did. But I had to check. And as soon as I checked, decided I was wrong, I paid him his rent. He be talking about how... He never have a problem with me, but I always got a problem with you. Why is that? Why is it that you can never have a problem with me, but I'm always having a problem with you? Why do I have to call you 10, 20, 15, 30 times for you to freaking... What are you doing, car? Girl, if you gonna turn, turn. Why do I have to call you 10 to 15 to 20 times for you to fix a problem? But yeah, you expect to get rent on time. Make it make sense. 
make it fucking make sense. But anywho, yeah, so I just want to tell y'all about my experience last night being in the trenches. But I just pulled up to see stuff. I hope this ain't no handicap park because this is a good one. Nope. Sure ain't. Um, yeah, I just got the sand spill, so let me go in here and zoom my little shop a lot in and see. I don't see y'all. I don't see y'all when I'm digging these guns. I'm with oat milk and caramel and stuff like that but today i just tried the signature pumpkin spice because y'all i normally don't like pumpkin spice nothing i'm not a pumpkin girl i ain't gonna say i don't like pumpkin spice nothing but i ain't never had no pumpkin spice nothing for real to even try so we're gonna see what it's doing deal without I could have deal without yeah whenever I whenever I drink coffee my face instantly starts like getting chills and like goosebumps my face just gets goosebumps as soon as I take a sip of coffee and it gets like itchy am I allergic or is that or is it waking my body up do that happen to y'all? Do y'all get chills and stuff? Or like weird skin reactions <laughs> to coffee? Because does that mean that I need to stop using it? I mean, not using it. Does that mean I need to stop drinking it? Because my face itch now. Or am I allergic to pumpkin spice? I don't know what I'm allergic to. I literally just started itching like fucking crazy. But yeah. Y'all, I can't stop it. It's like, please don't flash me. Please don't flash me. Please don't flash me. I do not need another red light camera ticket. I know my mama's sick of me getting them tickets into her house. Because I'm sick of it too. They really need to take these damn cameras out of the street. Because ain't no way in here we getting ticketed for going through a yellow light. And if I'm already speeding 75 in the 30, how do you expect for me to stop? Like, I better stop now. See, you see? Um, I couldn't even, I wasn't even able to stop. But I stopped. And here got my avocado toasty. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mmm. The last time I went to Dunkin' Donuts over by my mama's crib, I had went to Dunkin' Donuts over by my mama's crib. And... I had told the girl 
I had told the girl that I wanted an avocado toast. I had told the girl I wanted an avocado toast with bacon and the roasted tomatoes. Best way to get it, get it with both. She like, okay. But she repeated it to me. You want it with bacon and roasted tomatoes? I said, yeah. Y'all, why I get my damn thing? Now that I waited. Why I get my avocado toast? It just had roasted tomatoes on it. So I been the block. Hold on, show that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I waited in the, in the drive-thru. Ma'am, I just came. Um, you forgot to put the bacon on my avocado toast. And she's like, oh, you didn't say bacon. I said, yes, I did. And you repeated it to me. And she said, oh, I must have didn't hear you. I said, but you repeated it to me. But okay, well, you didn't put the bacon on there. She's like, well, we didn't charge you for the bacon. I asked for the bacon, though. I don't give a good hoot nanny. A good goddamn what you charged me for. I asked for the bacon. Child, I give her my damn we she like okay pull up to the to the light, to the window. I give her my damn thing back and I'm like, you know, sorry about that or whatever. I don't say sorry to her for whatever reason. I guess cause my customer service is always on point, like just from working in retail for so long. I feel like the customer service, customer service starts with the customer. Customer service starts with the customer, period, point blank. So I try to give good customer service even on the other end. So I'm like, you know, sorry about that or whatever. You know, I'm sorry if you didn't hear me. She ain't apologizing or nothing. She's like, oh, it's cool and grab my thing. Bitch, you ain't gonna say sorry to me. So she take the, take the avocado toast. And so she gave it back to me. So I'm like, yes. Y'all, I open it. The bitch put, she dumped a thing of barely cooked bacon on my sheet. This one I already left. And then the shit was like greasy. Like the grease was coming out of the damn Dunkin' thing container. I'm like, this bitch trying me. <laughs> Let me not go back though because I don't know how to fight. And you know, I be seeing too much on TikTok and Instagram and Facebook and all the other stuff. I be seeing too much of people getting their ass beat by these drive through workers. I don't want to be the one. <laughs> I'm not going to be the next one. No thanks. So. I just took it as a L and kept it moving and said, I just ain't never going back to that. But my thyroid is so swollen. Oh, my thyroid is so swollen. You can see it. Let me start back taking my medicine. I hate taking my thyroid medicine because it just makes me so groggy and it gives me nightmares. And it makes my heart beat real fast. So I, I stopped taking it. I would stop taking it for a few months and then start back taking it. I, I can't stand it. But I feel like I need to start back taking it, so I need to start back taking it. But yeah, anyway, y'all, so we on our way to Pete's Fresh Market. This pumpkin spice latte is all right with me. Will I get it again? No. <clears throat> but is it doing what it's supposed to do? Like choking the hell out of me, yeah. I hate that niggas in Chicago. I oh, I hate it so bad that niggas in Chicago buy these old fucking police cars. These old police cars. First of all, like these old detective cars. I think they're like Oldsmobile or something like that. I mean, it's cool. You get what you want to get. But stop pulling up on me, as, and then they still keep the police lights. That's the thing. I hate when they keep the police lights still on the cars. Boy, if you don't take that police car light off this damn car so I can stop being scared. You over here scaring me for no reason. You over here scaring me for no reason. Take the damn light off the side of the thing like you the damn popo. But these really the police right here. These really the police right here. No, it's not. These is fucking temporary plates. See? 
take the light off. And I think they starting to make these Fords like that, like police cars with the extra light on the thing. Y'all, sometimes I, my credentials ain't always right. So I, I, I need y'all to stop scaring me, being, being fake cops and shit. Ooh, makes my ass itch. Let me know what the hell is going on with my skin. I just randomly started breaking out in hives. Like, what the heck? <laughs> I literally only had that avocado and pumpkin spice latte today. And now my face is all breaking out. It was not earlier. Oh my God. This happens all the time, and I don't know from what, what causes it. Is it allergies? Is it what? But my skin just acts crazy. Oh, wow. It just acts so crazy sometimes. Look at it. Turn the light down so you guys can really see it. Like, what happened? Let me finish running my air so I can go in the house and take a damn Benadryl. Wow. Y'all, I think I might be allergic to rain. I honestly think I might be allergic to rain because it seems like every time it rains, I get the itching all over the body. Every single time, like if, if a raindrop or something touch my skin, I'm breaking the hives. I think I'm allergic to rain. I get an I know, I know y'all probably like this girl always talking about she, what she thinks she allergic to. I'm having an allergy test in, in two or three weeks. So. Lord, not knowing what you're allergic to, but always breaking out, it's too much. Like my tongue is even itchy. And I feel like if I was having a reaction to that, um, to that pumpkin spice, I probably would have had it while I was drinking it, right? I don't know. But something ain't right. My throat feel like it's closing a little bit. My skin just itch so bad from head to toe. I don't know what's going on with me. But something gotta give. And at first I was thinking like, you know, maybe it's, maybe it's, um, when I be hot boxing in the car, maybe it be too hot and fucking with my skin because you know, when I when I get hot, I be breaking out too in half. So I'm like, maybe it'd be too hot boxing it. And it got me breaking out. But the hot boxing is over. The hot boxing is over. And I'm still itchy. I feel like now I'm itchy in the brain, but I don't know. It's just like a man thing, but I don't know. Because right now, it feels like a body thing. Right now, it feels like a body thing. So, whatever it is, I'm scared. And I'm sick of it. And then I feel like it's like a part of my thyroid. Like, my thyroid being off, like, it can, different things can happen with your thyroid. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of being sickly and not knowing how sickly I am or not knowing what causes things to make me sick like what is it what is triggering me what is triggering me go figure you are the trigger like i'm triggered go figure you was the trigger rain i don't know what is the trigger that's what i'm trying to figure out now i want to hear that song Anyway, yeah, I'm finna go home and take me a Benny. I'm finna go home and pop me a Benny and, and take me a little 45 minute to an hour nap. 
before I gotta pick Simba up at three o'clock, cause baby, the way I'm feeling right about now, <laughs> yeah, I need me a Benny. I'm gonna go pop me a Benny real quick, for sure. For sure.